Updates! Everybody loves updates, especially when it comes to Funky Friday. They've been doing some pretty massive updates as of recent. But did you guys know that in the past, there have been some updates that were less fulfilling than others? Today we're going to be going over the three worst updates ever to come to Funky Friday. So make sure you guys smack the like and subscribe if you guys want to see even more amazing updates on the game. Don't forget to use star code attack and let's dive right into it. Now this is just a warning. I'm not going to be complaining about these updates or anything like that. I'm not Jeez. trying to make the developers feel bad about it or anything like that. But I thought it'd be cool to let you guys know about some of the smaller updates that have been uploaded to Funky Friday. First of which wasn't really a great one. And we're going all the way back to April 18th on this one. This is when they added two songs for the versus Matt mod. They added in boxing match and they also added in sporting as well. Literally, that was all the content. It was just two songs for the mod. That was pretty much it, other than like other tweaks and stuff like that. So this is back when Funky Friday was actually updating the game every couple of days. But imagine waiting two to three days for a new mod, you're pretty hyped up for a new mod, and then you see an update that only has two songs in them. Yeah, I would probably be a little upset too. But there was one good feature that they added in this update, and that was going to be the mobile portrait mode. Now a lot of people like to play mobile portrait, it's better than playing landscape. I haven't played it personally, but it's pretty cool that they added in during this one. The next update, in my opinion, is going to be the worst update in Funky Friday history. Like, this one's going to be pretty bad. But on June 7th, the developers added in a new mod, otherwise known as the Beach Brothers mod. Now, this update didn't look bad at all when it first came out. It had new animations, it had a bunch of cool new songs in the mod as well. Everybody looked happy, and everybody was very hyped for the summer as well. It wasn't until just two hours after, in which the mod ended up getting deleted from the game, and the animation ended up getting refunded as well. Now keep in mind guys, this mod was the only new content that they added in for this update here, as well as other tweaks and other optimizations done to the game. So this is pretty much the whole content for the update, and then two hours later, it got removed due to reasons. That's pretty bad. And the worst part was that people had to wait five days for this update yet. Like, people had to wait five days for a new mod, for new content on the game, only for the mod to last for two hours until it got deleted. It's pretty sad. Now, Jeez. I know this was not the developer's fault or anything like that. This was actually beyond their control. And it was really nice to see them work on an alternative update in which they add in the versus Cyrix and also versus Tree mod a couple of days after, which is really cool. But hands down, this was definitely the worst update in Funky Friday history, especially since there were no new songs even added into this one and for those of you who have been playing recently you guys probably have heard about this update as well it's a pretty recent update back on august 14th funky friday came up with a huge update adding the new bob and bosa weeks they added in the jump out songs they even added in the mammy demo as well they added so many songs so many map backgrounds so many animations it was probably going to be the biggest update ever but there was one major exploit that was found during this update which pretty much trashed the whole update there was a new feature that was introduced called the hitbox offset and basically what you can do with the setting is that you can change the timing of your inputs to when the arrows are going down near them so that means you can basically change the delay of your inputs which is pretty cool it was a good concept but there was a major exploit that was found with the setting if you set the setting all the way up to 1000 you can basically get a hundred percent six on any song that you want as long as the notes are showing up on the screen that means you can actually full combo songs like bob run for example which is pretty absurd and at that point a lot of people were not happy about it the community wasn't happy about it especially because everybody was utilizing this glitch and they're ruining other people's win streaks unfairly getting massive points it wasn't really fair it wasn't until hours later when the developers finally found a fix for it and they were able to patch that glitch but still a lot of people were not very happy with the glitch still coming out like that now this update definitely still is one of the best updates out there but before they patched that glitch it was definitely one of the worst updates ever in the game single-handedly due to that massive exploit but what did you guys think about it what was the worst update that you've ever had while you were playing funky friday let me know in the comments down below constructive criticism is always appreciated because we can always learn from it and that way we can make even better updates in the future as well but make sure you guys smack the like and subscribe especially if you want to see more and better updates on funky friday don't forget to use star code attack and we'll see you guys on the next one